What's up guys, it's me, your boy Steve Random here. And before we get into this video, I do apologize for, you know, taking about a week of a break from uploading. Um, not really an intentional break, it's just, it happens to be, you know, with college coming or starting up and then just filled with classes that are heavy uh, homework loaded. I know you guys don't want to hear about this, but I just thought I would let you guys know that I've been kind of busy, that's why I haven't been uploading as much. Also, if you guys notice, the background's kind of different, the lighting's kind of different too. Um, just trying some stuff out, seeing if this looks any better than what it did previously. It's a little bit more of a calm vibe, um, kind of gets you to maybe relax while watching the videos, which I sometimes want you guys to do. But nonetheless, let's get into this video, which is going to be about Parfums de Marley Perceval. This is just a quick uh, little segment on how the bottle looks. It has this like slightly light blue color. Just on the camera, it looks kind of dark, but it is kind of light blue. Standard kind of Parfums de Marley bottle with a nice sprayer that uh, is really, really nice. Um, you know, your standard Parfums de Marley bottle, just a different color. So, um, Parfums de Marly, Percival, let's get get it out the way. I like, you know, to speak the truth with you guys. Um, obviously, you guys have come to this video just to kind of, you know, probably see my opinion, but also see a truthful opinion. And I know this fragrance wasn't uh, such well appreciated when it first came out. It was very... I guess a little bit of a controversial release because people were like this isn't worth it this smells like whatever else you want to say and it just there's a lot of um, kind of uh, responses from people that weren't I guess positive um, but to me I like to say my own opinion and I also respect the opinion of others but I also just like to say my opinion just to be out there and let you guys know what I think of this. So, Percival to me, actually really smells good. Um, now there's a few certain things I have to mention when I say smells good. It does smell generic though. It does smell like a shower gel uh, fragrance, but to me, it is the ultimate shower gel fragrance. I'm gonna post a picture up of what I think it, it is. This basically, this Dove, body wash, the I think it's called Extra Fresh, I forgot what it was, but I used to use it a long time ago, but it really does smell exactly like that. So if you guys are like, Percival, you know, I never got to try it, uh, never got to try it out, it's been out for a little bit, I just never came to trying it out, well, you have an easy access, um, you know, if you go to your local Walmart, your local whatever store, they should probably be carrying the Dove body wash um, extra fresh. I'm going to post a picture of it anyway. You guys just probably saw it. Just crazy how close this fragrance smells to that. So now that I got that out the way, obviously you guys know it's generic, you know, because it smells like something else. It smells like a lot of uh, just fresh and clean smelling fragrances. This one also has this kind of... Uh, I guess you would call the well-known, uh, I, I don't know how to really phrase this better, but the well-known shaving gel kind of uh, scent. You know, when you look at typical shaving gel scents, they have this particular scent that you recognize when you smell one of those products, you know. You smell, like for example, the extra fresh one, a lot of stuff smells similar to the extra fresh body wash. Um, and you're just all in that kind of same category, uh, that deodorant, uh, kind of um, Old Spice kind of vibe, uh, just that generic kind of smell. But to me, this fragrance uh, does it pretty well. I, I just, it just doesn't really do as well as um, it is in terms of like surprising. Girls really expect the smell all the time from a guy, uh, it's just your typical, you know, uh, clean smell. So it's not really any surprise to a girl. But while I've been wearing this, it has received positive um, comments. 
And it's also out of my collection, there's only a certain bunch in the collection that actually receive comments and receive feedback on them. There's a lot of fragrances in my collection that I, I mean, I don't personally care. I wear whatever I like, but there is a lot of fragrances that people don't really mention when you have them on. They don't really say, well, this fragrance is nice or you smell good or they just give you any compliment. People don't usually do that with a lot of my fragrances that I wear, but for some reason with this one and including others that are, you know, on my most complimented list, this, is, this isn't on the most complimented list, but this one is one that has received feedback from people. Um, and I believe it's the uh, silage of this one. Um, it really does stay up kind of floating around in the air. And it also smells like I just took a shower. I put extra shower gel or I put shaving gel on. It just kind of smells like a more natural after a shower kind of vibe. And honestly, I don't know what to say apart from the fact that this fragrance is good full stop. Like there isn't anything else. It isn't extremely good. It isn't extraordinary. It isn't bad. Unless, you know, you don't like using cleaning body washes or anything like that. If you don't like using those products, you know, like that typical, what's been advertised as like a man smell, those stuff, if you don't like using that stuff, then you won't like using this one. Um, because it just fits right into that category of, you know, that, I'm sure you guys have seen those commercials when they, you know, they have this certain like hair gel or shaving gel and they just show this man on the commercial and he's like using the shaving gel he's cleaning out his beard and he's like all clean and that that kind of scent that you know fits for that category is what percival is um and i, I know i've described the scent quite a bit but i'm just trying to make it clear to you guys and trying to give you kind of exactly what i think it smells like um, because I guess that's my point, you know, my point is to help you guys out with fragrances. Um, so, Percival, overall, good is the best I can give it. It's a solid, for me, 8 out of 10. It's like as good as you get without going beyond good, um, or below good. It's like just on the dot, solid, pretty much, is what I can... I can say. It's a good fragrance, like, I don't know, it's hard to dislike it. I mean, I, the only reason I would dislike it is because I'm just like, yep, here we go, another fresh scent, or another after, you know, shower kind of gel, whatever, shaving gel, fresh gel, my ass gel, it's all that stuff, it's just, it's just kind of that, you know, regular old old spice kind of scent yeah, yeah i see that point that people make and i would also dislike it if i was coming from that angle but to me i'm just looking at a fragrance as being a fragrance that i could use to smell good and to get a few other checkpoints like getting compliments um making sure it does last long um another point is uh, relative price and so the price I'm going to insert on the screen, to me, the retail price for sure is not worth it. And discounted price, I paid uh, 150 US dollars for this. I recommend it for probably, let's say, about 100, 120. I mean, it is a Parfums de Mali in the end of the day, so it will be more expensive. But if I had to price this fragrance without knowing the company or without knowing anything about it, I would probably put it at the 100, 120 range because it does have that, you know, obvious uh, shower gel um, kind of vibe, but it also does last long and it doesn't really change much. So it just stays consistent as this shower gel vibe. And that's pretty much it. The whole fragrance is pretty much shower gel. So you could say, you know, why don't I keep 150 in my pocket and just use this Dove uh, body wash, extra fresh, um, you know, thing? Why not? Why don't I use that? Um, and you know, just spend like six dollars and just use that body wash. Well, I guess I I can't really argue against that. I 
myself would probably do that if I didn't want to pay 150 for this. But at the same time, you could do both. You know, it wouldn't hurt to be extra fresh when you uh, have this on. But honestly, this one, I would say for the price uh, as where it is, you know, for the 150 or 160, 170 dollar range is where discounters are, are having it at the moment. I would say I would give it a shot. I would actually first probably go smell that Dove body wash um, extra fresh thing and then decide if you want to have a fragrance that smells like that because you know the scent out of that body wash is very commonly used and is I think is well liked by um, men and and women. So that's um, Parfums de Marley Percival. I hope this uh, this um, review clears up some things you might have on this fragrance. I want to stay consistent this year and um, try to do my best with uh, both college and YouTube. And yeah, I uh, also appreciate you guys, um, you know, staying patient with me. Um, I have been using the uh, community uh, posts that I've been up, you know, saying stuff on. I've been like saying, okay, I'm gonna upload today, tomorrow. And that I don't end up uploading but I uh, got a video out today for you guys and yeah that's been it I've been ranting a lot this video it's not my usual kind of self because it is 12 uh, 20 a.m. at the moment and this is the grind you know just finished up some homework finished up some uh, stuff um, that I had to do uh, for tomorrow and the day after so I'm getting a little bit ahead but it comes down to you know recording a video at 12 20 a.m. so hope you guys enjoyed it and peace